Hey guys, so I'm Russell Mann. Welcome to Living in Racine. So this week we're discussing one of my favourite subjects of all time. Fishing in Racine. Yeah, so I am I love fishing. All types, sea fishing, lake fishing, river fishing, freshwater fishing, what you name it, I love doing it. My particular favourite is fly fishing. But I also do other types as well. Um, when I first moved over here, I was fortunate enough. I got involved in a club, um, not in Racine, but in Kenosha, the KSFCA. And I'm now fortunate enough to be president of that club. Um, so, yeah, I've just taken over as president of the Kenosha Sports Fishing and Conservation Association. And we get involved in the community a lot. We um, help with several events like the Kids Fish and Fun. We reared uh, 40,000 Chinook salmon this year at the Rearing Pond, which we released into Lake Michigan. So really good to be involved with that. And coming up uh, this month is... Uh, in September 21st is when we do the Pike River cleanup. So, but that's in Kenosha, not in Racine. So, let me tell you about fishing in Racine then. Join me right after this. Yeah. So when it comes to fishing in Racine, obviously you've got Lake Michigan where you're going to, you know, you can catch coho salmon, king salmon or chinooks. You can catch lake trout, brown trout, rainbow trout, as well as numerous other fish that are in the lake. Now throughout uh, Racine you've got the Root River that runs through most of it and there are some great spots up and down the Root River that you have access to. Most of the parks that run alongside the river have access points to the river for fishing so there's car parks you can get in there now, a great thing if you want to take kids along is under 16, they don't need a license. So, they, you know, they haven't got to buy their own license to go fishing. So you can take them out there as long as you've got a license. But they can go fishing for free. And what a great day out it is. Go down to the lake, tie a fly on or a spinner or, you know, whatever you use as bait. And sit there and watch your you bob off, you know, float away and go under. It's the best feeling ever. You know, my best feeling is if I've tied a fly and I take it down to the river and I try it out and I catch a fish on it. That's an amazing feeling because I love fly tying. I also love fly fishing. But I also do the other types of fishing at times as well. And so there's nothing like sitting on the bank of the river, casting your hook out and catching dinner. It's a great feeling. So as I said, up and down the Root River, there's loads of places along there um, that you can catch fish. Uh, and even you've got the steelhead facility in Racine. Um, around there, that's where they gather the steel, steelheads when they're spawning to collect eggs and so um, during the time they're collecting eggs there is an area which is off ground um, it's off the cards you're not allowed to fish there um, but you can fish prior to and after that area um, it's just so that they can collect the data that they need and all the eggs and and everything so we have a fishery for the future so as I say it's nice to get out there um, I mean we can fish almost all year round guys in Racine you know you've got um, largemouth bass in the river 
and you know you can catch them March to October. You've got crappies, bluegill, uh, walleye, uh, northern pike, perch, smallmouth bass, to name but a few. But the big ticket ones is the rainbow trout. Now they're pretty much the best time of the year to catch those is September through to April. Um, that's the rainbow trout or steelhead as they're called. Um, brown trout is April to October is the best time for those. Lake trout June to August short period but really worth catching. We caught a couple last year um, out on the boat in the, in the lake on the big water. Um, coho salmon May through June is the best times for those and chinook or kings april to july so you've got a really good season there but you can fish for anything musk is april to november you know you can pretty much go all year round in racine you even get them fishing out on the ice you know when it's frozen over the lake freezes they're out down by reef point marina or onto the lake and fishing so it's a great area, you can go up and down the lake in a small draft boat if you wish. Or you can, you know, travel to one of these parks and get out there, get your waders on or just fish from the bank. There's plenty of opportunity, but it's not just the river. There's also all the lakes in and around Racine County as well. You know, there's some great lakes like Browns Lake over in Burlington, um, not too far away. There's some great areas. We even have the Fox River that comes through part of it where you can fish there as well. So we've got some really, really good opportunities. Um, you know, I love it. I've been doing it ever since I moved over here. So since 2015. I joined a club. Now there's also a great club in Racine. If you don't want to go into Kenosha and to, uh, you know, be become part of that club, there's a great club here in Racine called Salmon Unlimited, Wisconsin. They're really good. They do the Salmonarama competition, but they also have kids events as well. The same as we do at KSFCA, um, we do our kids fish and fun. Would they do a similar event here in Racine for the kids? They get the kids fishing and uh, they really want to get involved in the community and help and they do the conservation. Now we do the Pike River cleanup because that's in Kenosha for our club. The Salmon Unlimited do the Root River cleanup. So certain areas once a year they'll go down there and they'll clean that area up so everyone can enjoy the fishing but it obviously takes a lot of volunteers to do this work so you know if if you don't want to join but you want to volunteer why not contact them you can look them up their website is salmon unlimited uh, wisconsin or if you want to get involved in our group at kenosha you go to kenosha sports fishing and conservation association and uh, we'd love to see you there or you know pop along to your salmon unlimited meeting if you want to stay local or look for any other club if you're not local to the city of racine you live out in burlington maybe have a look see if there's a closer club for you that you want to get involved in great speaking to you and uh, if you have any questions drop them in the comments below and why not um Tell us what your favourite tackle is, what you like to use. Do you use a spinner? Do you do fly fishing? Or do you go with the worm or the bait? What type of fishing do you prefer? Let us know. I'd love to hear from you. And why not send us some pickies of the fish you've caught? I'd love that too. So, bye for now.